Hey there, collectives, and welcome back for another separation general love reading. This one is going to be for, of course, Scorpios. Shout out to all the beautiful Scorpios of the world. I love that you rock with me because I rocks right back with you. Okay, Scorpios. So Scorpios, tap in and let's see what's going on in your relationship in this time of separation. Scorpio, these are general readings, so they're not going to resonate for every single Scorpio out here. So please use your highly intuitive selves, honey, and only take the part that fits and discard the rest. So let's see. Here, show me the energy for Scorpios in love during this time of separation. What's going on between Scorpio and a person spirit in this time of separation spirit? Show me. All right, Scorpio, you can reverse the roles. Do how you feel like you need to, honey. All right, so your overall energy is daughter of knives here. So this is the Knight of Pentacles. The Knight of Pentacles, I see the Magician card. <clears throat> I see the Knight, of, the Knight of Swords and the Magician card. So someone may be uh, trying to, someone may, <laughs> may feel like they need to try to make something happen. Someone may feel pressed for time and they may feel this urgency to rush in to try to uh, establish something to get something. The hermit card, someone could be, it could be no movement, especially if it's in a separation, a separated relationship. It's almost like somebody wants to bust in and make something happen here. So let's see, Spirit, show me Scorpios in separation. What's going on between Scorpio and Scorpio's person in this time of separation? So you have the eight of coins here. Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn here. Scorpios in separation. <clears throat> so you have the tower. Look at you showing up in your reading, honey. Ooh, so somebody may be about to surprise you right up on you. Because what's crowning the uh, tower, your energy is the daughter of knives here. Ooh. All right, Spirit, what else for Scorpios in separation? Show me Scorpios in separation. Mm -mm, Scorpio, you showed up in your own reading, honey. Uh, the mother of coins, queen of pentacles here. So see you you working on thing you look like on thing you're focusing on right now is your job and your career here unless it's them but I feel like they this night trying to rush in the eight of wands see <laughs> eight of coins eight of wands here somebody's trying to make something happen the hermit card I feel like someone is trying to see they go the lovers card see Gemini energy see. Could be dealing with the Gemini Scorpios. You could be dealing with the Pisces, another Scorpio, a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. So with this Eight of Wands and the Eight of Coins, it's almost like you may receive a message. Somebody may want to try to uh, communicate or come to you, <clears throat> or maybe you them, and try to work things out with this Eight of Pentacles. And I feel like it's going to be a surprise to you. Because this person may be kind of aggressive, kind of pushy, uh, because maybe they feel like uh, maybe maybe they could be looking at you, Scorpio, like especially in this mother of coins. If this is your energy, then it could represent that they could be looking at you like you're only focusing on your career and your stability and you don't have time. So this could be why someone may feel like they have an urgency to, to make haste. Uh, they may could possibly see you manifesting here, Scorpio. See, because crowning this mother of coins here, you have the magician. So it's almost like if they're watching you and they see some growth in your life, financially, business-wise, they see you manifesting, then it's making them want to hurry up and rush in on you. And I feel like for some of you, Scorpio, this person may pop up on you. And for others, it, 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 the, the realization may be of this person realizing that you are going on with your life and you're no longer invested because you're focusing on your stability and your job. Let's see. <clears throat> All right. The daughter of knives here, the knight of knives, the a knight of swords here. Spirit, why is this a daughter of knives here for Scorpios in separation? Clarify. Clarify the daughter of knives for Scorpios in separation. Clarify the knight of swords for Scorpios in separation. 
Eight of Wands. They go to Eight of Wands again. I told you. See, somebody want to talk to you. They go to Eight of Wands again. See? I, like I said, I feel like someone wants to make haste. Somebody either wants to travel to you or they feel an urgency to come to you here. Look with some type of offer, but look what it is. It's a page of pentacles. They are night. They coming up in this night energy. Oh, but it could be a king of swords here. <laughs> Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius here. Somebody here who is in this nostalgia energy thinking about you. And they may be thinking about the pain that they have caused. And it may have could have been because it was other uh, people involved. Or maybe this person has been thinking about you and they're fantasizing. See, they're fantasizing about you. The two of cups here. Ooh, and then for some of y'all, this person had a choice of a lover and their soulmate here, okay? Mm. Wow, Scorpio. <laughs> All right, Spirit, why is the Knight of Swords here for Scorpios in separation? Clarify. Page of Wands. They just, they steady trying to come in with this. Maybe this is a message here. But I feel like this is someone here who is studying you. Look, the King of Wands, this is somebody here. Now, you could be dealing with the Leo, Sagittarius, or Aries here. But someone is observing you, and they feel the see, four wands here. Someone has an urgency to rush in at you. Look, they go to Ace of Cups, and they go to Justice card here. It's almost like somebody's, I feel like somebody's going to either pop up on your job or pop up at your house with this four wands energy. And if they do... They could possibly be looking good and smelling good. And you know what I'm saying? They're going to be on their they game. <laughs> oh, snap. You know, you know you don't pop up to no ex looking raggedy now. Come on. Everybody know that that's the, I know that, one-on-one. <laughs> okay? <laughs> that's like, that's like you trying to take yourself out of here. Okay? <laughs> you never show up to a ex looking like it's that time of the month. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> Oh, this is funny, but for some of y'all, this person may try to pop up on you at your house here with this King of Wands and this Four of Wands here. Because you see all this communication. Got the uh, Knight of Swords along with the Eight of Wands and the uh, Page of Wands. See? So there's a lot of action here. Like I said, it could be, you could be dealing with the Taurus, I mean, Leo, Sagittarius, or Aries here. So let's see what this Tower card is. That's your energy, Scorpio. Spirit, you could be, like I said, could be dealing with another Scorpio here. Spirit, why is the Tower card here for Scorpios in separation? Clarify, please, for Scorpios in this Tower. <clears throat> Clarify the Tower. Why is the Tower card here for Scorpios in separation? Mm -mm, because of the ten of swords here <laughs> who somebody having a realization maybe this was a tower moment with you and your person maybe they did the most to you and i feel like it caused you to walk away something caused you to walk away from your emotions here or maybe they're having a tower moment and they have been betrayed or they have been done wrong or a major disappointing it's like a horrible ending to something here or a very very um uh, burdensome ending spirit why is the tower card here for scorpios in separation Oof. scorpio y'all got some y'all energy got is trying to talk here <laughs> scorpio gonna tell it <laughs> you don't have to worry because scorpio gonna let you know honey all right spirit why is the tower card here for scorpios in separation <laughs> oh snap you got the queen of wheels the knight of wands Ooh, the queen of wands and the nine of cups in the reverse here. Wow. I feel like someone is finding out that someone was the player here. Okay. Because you got the knight of wands here. You got the knight of wands in between a queen of pentacles and a queen of wands here. With the nine of cups and somebody was overindulging. Someone was greedy here. Somebody's now either you're finding this out. I'm not gonna take all these. I'm gonna put them put some more. Either you're finding out all of this, or this is this person's lifestyle is coming down. The way that they live their life. Because you remember you got the king of wands trying to come to you with the four of wands. So they may have been out here reckless in the, in the knight of wands, but they're trying to come in to you as the king of wands, I feel like. So you got the tower and the ten of swords spirit. Why is the tower here for Scorpios? This is some deep stuff. Page of Pentacles here. I feel like someone is realizing that they didn't get much out of it, that somebody wasn't taking it serious. And it was a burden to them, 10 of Wands, but I feel like somebody released it. It's the Tower card. <clears throat> mm -mm, it's the 
Scorpio. This is something. Who why is the tower card here for Scorpios? In separation spirit. What's going on here? Five of Pentacles here. Somebody got left out in the cold here. Or somebody left somebody else out in the cold. Maybe you did it with the nine of Pentacles. Oh, yeah, you did it. Scorpio, you, so you ain't no goddamn me freaking joke. Nine of Pentacles with the freaking death card here. See? Ooh, 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 ooh. Scorpio, you put that Scorpio-isms-ness on them. You got the Magician card again. Like I say, somebody, see, you manifesting here, Scorpio. And I feel like you decided to get out of this situation here. And it was a tower moment. The whole thing was a tower moment for some of y'all, for whoever. It's just like the whole relationship had to come to an end because somebody uh, was taking your kindness for weakness, I feel like. So why is this Eight of Wands here for Scorpios in separation? Clarify the Eight of Wands. Eight of Wands is the world card. See, I feel like you're moving on or someone once again after you've already ended it because I feel like this is re <laughs> these are returns <laughs> but, but look no refund okay no exchange you get no money back you can't come back that's what it should go with huh <laughs> but you know sometimes you can change sometimes relationships can change for the better it, they can um anything is possible as far as I'm concerned but you got the eight of wands here you already have the eight of wands I feel like this is someone here who wants to come back for a new opportunity, uh, or maybe you ended it and you didn't, you didn't, you, things are taken off for you and your business, your life, and you ain't got no reason to look back here. Let's see, Spirit, why is the Eight of Wands here? Or maybe this person want to come, ooh, the Two of Cups, see, huh? They trying to come back here. See, they go to Knight of Swords, there it is again. Behind the scenes, it's almost like... <laughs> Oh my goodness, almost like behind the scenes here. This person is they in their feelings here, Scorpio. Whoever this person is, behind the scenes, this person really, really is in their feelings here with the Knight of Swords and the Moon card here. It's almost like this person is transformed. They're not themselves here. Uh, since you have walked away, it's almost like little do you know you had more control over this relationship than you realized, this Scorpio. But I feel like this person's trying to re-enter your life behind the scenes. <clears throat> I feel like this person does not like the fact or did not like the fact that they felt this connection with you. It's almost like somebody was trying to fight the feelings, but I feel like it happened anyway. Maybe they weren't supposed to fight. Maybe they weren't supposed to catch feelings. After all, you got the Knight of Wands. Maybe somebody wasn't looking for love, you know, but they they found it anyway. So now you got the Eight of Coins here. Spirit, why is the Eight of Coins here for Scorpios in separation? Eight of Coins here for you, Scorpio. It's the Eight of Cups here. See, some of y'all like, you know what? I'm going to go on and just work on myself and work on my money and work on my Scorpio life. Because this here ain't getting me nowhere. You say, you know what? I'm going to trade them eight of cups in for them eight of pentacles. <laughs> you say them pentacles ain't going to never fail you. Oh, look at you, Scorpio, making wise decisions here, Scorpio. Spirit, clarify the eight of coins for Scorpios in separation. Oof. Some of y'all stressing out. They go to ace of cups. Eight of coins. You got the eight, eight in here. Clarify the eight of coins for Scorpios in separation spirit. Eight of coins is clarified. <laughs> you left your lovers. What you left, you left third party situation. Look at three people right there. See there, you walked away. I feel like everybody leaving this person. You see, both of them looking at two. Ain't neither one of them looking at me like, but dude, you, you play it out. No, I feel like this person is alone now. <laughs> Whoever this person is, I feel like they are alone. Whoever the third party is, everybody got tired of this person here. And I feel like everybody turning their back on this person here. But you have walked away from the third. See, you say you walking away from the devil. And all of you said, devil, you a lie. <laughs> I ain't got to share my love. I just won't be around here. Y'all ain't got Y'all don't need me in there. See that? The hierophant in reverse of somebody that wasn't looking for a relationship. They just looking for fun. You walked away from it here. Now they are mad at you because they feel some type of way about it. They mad at you because they because they because they feel this push and pull towards you and they can't fight it. So energetically, spiritually, this person has a because you got the knight of swords twice. 
So behind the scenes, this person really is angry that they are in love with you. And that's weird. Now you got the magician card here, the Pisces energy. Spirit, why is the magician card here for Scorpios in separation? Oof. See, I'm telling you, spirit trying to tell off on somebody. Somebody angry because they, they in love with you because they was living a certain type of life and you, you got away. All right, spirit, the magician card for Scorpios in separation. Why is this card here, spirit? Clarify. <clears throat> Three of wheels. I feel like you're manifesting a new opportunities here, your way here. And it could very well be them trying to manifest you. They could be trying to manifest you too, Scorpio. You clarify the magician, but they don't know that they're manifesting you. They don't know it. Or you just could be manifesting all types of good things to happen to you. See, Knight of wheels. Some of you guys have been waiting for new opportunities financially in your life here. See, what is that? See, the empress, some of y'all been trying to grow something. Y'all been waiting on this person and y'all like, uh-uh, <laughs> finally y'all said, nope, I'm not stressing over you anymore. I'm leaving this. I know my worth now. See there, some of y'all have manifested some growth in your life in this magician card here. You're tired of waiting on this person. I feel like you're having to build things, but I also feel like the universe is sending you support too with the three of pentacles here. With the magician card, see, it's almost like whatever somebody, when you walked away from a toxic environment or a toxic relationship, that's when you start to grow and, and, and elevate and grow here. And now they're behind the scenes mad at you because they in love with you because you done left them because they wasn't shit. Okay, one more card for the magician card for Scorpios in separation. Could be dealing with the Libra or Pisces here. See, Queen of Wheels, and you focusing on that bag now. See, that's what you're focusing on your stability now. Like I say, you went on and you decided to work, and that's 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 pretty much the things for everybody. Because you realize when you find relationships that are not investing in you, this is for any zodiac signs. What I'm getting is the collective of the world. When you, the, most people are looking for somebody who is compatible that they can build with. Most people want love too, but the majority of the people ain't dating for love no more. They, they dating for stability. And it seems like when it's an unhealthy connection with nothing but the materialisticness of the relationship, that's when it falls apart because you have to balance it. You can't just be all lovey, lovey, lovey in no relationship either. You have to balance it. But it seems like these masculine just been out here just acting ruthless because they've had multiple options. But they're losing. It's like the, the one who, who they hate to deny that they in love with, they're angry at you. So now you got the mother of earth, which is the queen of pentacles again here. See, you about your stability, Scorpio, and somebody is mad at you, Scorpio. And not only that, some of y'all holding back. <laughs> You're holding back from the Knight of Wands type of energy, you see? And this is why they're mad because I feel like whenever you walked away from this person, you must have never went back. Maybe this person's been waiting on you to call them or come back to them or something, but you never did because you're the Empress energy. You had to uh, grow up and you did some work on yourself here, see? And now you and now it's, it's showing what this person really was made of. They're more emotional than you, but they're emotional uh, baggages is coming through the the the, uh, the energy of their thoughts here, and it's, it's hating. Somebody's got some hating energy, but they mad at you because you're con you're protecting your happiness in this nine of cups here. See nine of cups. See there it is again. Queen of Wands energy. I told you. See, <laughs> you got the same thing going on here with that Queen of Wands. And see, you got the Empress here. And you got, did I see the queen of one? It must've been another read here. See, you, this is why somebody's trying to come back to you because they had a passionate connection with you because I see the king of wands here, but you're not chasing this person. Whoever this person is, you're not chasing them and it bothers them. See, because you're holding back with the four of pentacles because you already know what time it is. You like, boy, ain't nobody. I don't, I am, I am not impressed. Boy, I done seen everything about you. You ain't got nothing else. You ain't learned nothing else since the last time we seen each other. Well, then I am not impressed. You could be dealing with the Aries or a Aquarius here. But I feel like you are moving towards your destiny and your wishes being fulfilled here. And nothing can stop you. And now somebody is hating on you because they messed around and lost a very, very, very good thing. Because I don't see no emperor but I sure see this empress, though, and I know that's you, Scorpio. 
All right, Scorpio, this is your reading, honey, in separation. So if it resonates, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you so much, Scorpios.